What's up everyone? It's Anna, also known as that Star Wars girl, and today I'm going to be doing a reaction review to the Dark Phoenix trailer. Now, I was doing a live stream last night, and everyone was getting me hyped about it. They're like, Yeah, you need to go watch the Dark Phoenix trailer, and I was like, Alright, I'll just let everyone know now. I, I'm not, like, I like... Jean Grey, but she's never been my favorite out of the X-Men. I would much prefer a movie about a different character, but I do understand, you know, the strength that Jean Grey has. So, I'm interested to see, you know, this portrayal of it, but at the same time, I, I know you're not supposed to do this, but... Sometimes I have a hard time, you know, separating, you know, the actor, actress from a previous role they played. So, for instance, the girl that plays Jean Grey, uh, Sophie Turner, I think is her name. I, so, Tulip, calm down! I cannot stand Sansa. Like, I hate Sansa. And so when I see Sophie Turner playing Jean Grey, I'm just like, all I see is Sansa. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try really hard, you know, not... To let that bother me. But that being said, Magneto is one of my all-time favorite characters. And I love, you know, the friendship between Magneto and Professor Xavier. So I'm interest I'm more interested to see that than I am to see Jean Grey. But you know what? I'm going to give this a shot. Let's see how it goes. Let's see if it lives up to the hype that everyone was telling me about. Alright, let's check it out. Alright, everyone. I have the trailer pulled up. I'm... I don't know how I feel about it, but you know what, we're going to check it out. And I apologize if you guys hear any weird noises. My puppy is going crazy on the floor. Alright, yes, Professor. Okay. Why did you make me do that? What happened? Look at me. Focus on my voice. Uh, I don't like I'm her not wig. Giving up on you, Jean. She was my friend. You're my family, Jean. Stop. No matter what. Stop. 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 Hmm. Look. You're special, Jean. And if you stop fighting that force inside you, hmm. If you embrace it. He will possess the very power of a god. She'll kill us all. No, oh my god. Tell me how we fix this, Charles. Tell me what to do, and I don't know what to do. Oh, they don't understand what they fear and what they fear. They seek to destroy. I love that actress. It's your fault, Charles. I tried to protect her. Just shoot her with the dart, with, you know, the little thing that makes you not a mutant anymore. <laughs> I don't think it's invented yet, though. The girl dies. She's still Jean. We can still help her. Sometimes. You want to believe people as something that they are not. By the time you realize who they are. It's too late. She's coming. At least she's gonna save them and not kill them. Well, there is my reaction, or lack thereof. Like I said in the beginning of this video, she's never really been my favorite character. The only time where I actually really like Jean Grey is, you know, the dynamic between her and Wolverine. Now, Wolverine, he's my second favorite character in the X-Men universe, so when there's a character I like and there's another character I don't like, but there's that, you know, bond between them and the character I do like, it makes me care about that character more. So because I see how much Logan cares about Jean, it makes me, you know, want 
the best for them. It makes you me, you know, not want bad things to happen. And so in instances like this, it's like, obviously Logan is not there. He has not been introduced to them yet. So it's like, I really don't, I mean, she's just never been my favorite character. I would much rather see a movie about Storm, about Rogue. Heck, I'd rather see a movie about Beast than Jean. But, I mean, I don't know. I've just... She's never been my favorite. And my favorite X-Men character is Magneto. I love, love, love Magneto. And I love the dynamic between him and Professor Xavier. I love stories about friendship. So, just how... They started, like, I, I do really like these, you know, prequel movies, if you would, about, you know, them and how they came to be and how they met and, you know, all this dynamics between them. I really like that. And, you know, just seeing that, you know, they're the best friends, but they just have completely different opinions and, you know, watch their different paths. I really enjoy that because you, you know that they still care about each other. They're still best friends. They just, you know, have completely different opinions on the way things should be happening. And... That's the kind of dynamic I like that's intriguing to see. This, I'm just like, okay, she's got a lot of power. And I, I know what the story is. Uh, I did, you know, I, I know what this is. But uh, obviously it's going to be different on the big screen. And I, I probably will go see this, but just because Magneto is in it. Because Magneto and Professor Xavier are in it. I mean, that... That look, that was the best part of this trailer for me. And even when I watched X Men Apocalypse, and everyone was like, "Ooh, there's like showing Dark Phoenix," or they're like, you know, leading on that we're gonna get a Dark Phoenix movie. And I was like, "Yeah, they probably will," because Sophie Turner is big in Game of Thrones right now, so they want to use her and like show Jean Grey and everything, which I get, but it's just it's just not my cup of tea. And I, I know everyone has their own preferences. I know a lot of people do like this character, so this is probably just you know my opinion. That's like. An unpopular one but that's okay I mean this it's probably gonna be a great movie I just would have preferred it about a different character so everyone I hope you liked this video if you did go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you didn't that's okay too and if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel and make sure you click that little bell that way you no get notifications when I put out other videos and when I do live streams because people really tend to like my live streams my puppy tulip is usually in them right now she's on the floor going crazy but everyone I hope you have a great rest of your day, and may the force be with you, because we are really, really going to need it. Bye. Hey everyone, after being asked for months now, I finally got a P.O. box, so if you want to send me some mail, go ahead and send it to Anna, that Star Wars girl, or TSWG for short, at P.O. Box number 28171, Santa Ana, California, 92799-8171. Thank you, have a great day, guys.